welcome 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 how is everyone feeling today um if you guys are new to my channel it's your girl coco and yeah i do general readings um with you guys so we can make it through this crazy thing called life um it's a gloomy day here in california um, I'm excited because I'm going out tonight, so I'm going to be able to, I guess, you know, shake what I got on the dance floor. <laughs> it's like, if you guys are into TikTok, it's whatever. Um, And so, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys some messages from Spirit today. It's Friday, December 2nd. Um, so let's see what messages Spirit has for us today. So let's get into it. <sighs> Heavenly Father, Ancestor, Spirit, Guides, and Protective Angels, thank you so much for waking us up today on this dawning. I appreciate all the abundant substance and prosperity that you give us on an everyday basis, all the knowledge, love, and insight that you also give. Today, I'm going to be doing a reading for the collective, um, anything that they don't see, and also what's in their person's mind. Um, I love you so much. I appreciate everything that you do. I appreciate all the opportunities that you give us on an everyday basis. And um, for us to use all of our senses and be around the people that we love and for me to even share these messages, um, if you can make sure that they come out clear, um, you know how I read. So, amen. And if you're not called upon this reading, you're not welcome. Amen. Okay. Um, so, yeah, let's start. What? Oh, I'm getting crazy. You guys... Hold on. What messages do you have today for the collective? Lovers. Okay. So maybe some of you guys are thinking really toughly about a love connection that you have with someone. Um, you guys have a really strong love connection, but it's almost like it's not that you're falling out of love it's it's hard to keep each other enticed in the relationship so you guys aren't necessarily like cheating one person maybe i don't know and i can't say this for everybody but um it's hard to keep you know it's like it's hard for this person to keep like this angel bound you see that she's like all right i need to like float away he's like wait like just come down here just come down here really quick um let me see oh my gosh are these cards nude all of them my card not all of them but like most of them are anyways um what other messages do we have for the collective six of swords so one of you feels like they're taking like on all the burden pretty much of the connection it's like maybe your person feels like um they invested a lot so it's like they're not gonna get like these swords back pretty much like the things that they invested they're not gonna see a return on their investment but it's also like someone told me the other day it wasn't someone told me i was watching a podcast with b simone i think and uh, megan ashley and they were talking about how if they wanted to be in a relationship or if they're going to be in another relationship they're going to come in the relationship like this is what i have you need to add to my purpose and i'll add to your purpose and i think that that's a good way to think about it, it was it was how she said it the wording and i knew what she meant but the wording was kind of different but i know it was just like this is her purpose and this is the life she's living so almost like if you can't keep up with that like i'm gonna need someone else that aligns with my purpose and i think that that's a really good way of thinking about it um but also i heard someone else and i think it was dr umar he was also talking um, and he also said that people now, when they get in relationships, they try to capitalize off of the relationship and the other person. But if you guys both go in saying, hey, this is how I want to help you, um, both of you guys get better. 
And so that's something very interesting that I feel like we don't really adapt in today's um, society or way of dating or anything like that. So um, this person feels like, you know, they're not going to get a return on their investment. Like you see how everyone else in the back is getting like a return, like their boats are coming in. So this person doesn't feel like their boats are coming in um, when it comes to like, you know, the love that they give. Uh, but everyone is loved different, you know, and you have to communicate that with your partner. <sighs> Sorry, you guys, I feel like. Um, what other messages? I have the Nine of Swords in the Tower. So what is this about? What is this about? I don't know if you guys saw this. The Tower and the Nine of Swords. So because someone's so in their head, it looks like it could cause like a tower moment. Or you know what I'm saying? Like it's all in your head. The Nine of Swords is almost like, well, first of all, it's the Ten of Swords, but the Nine of Swords is almost like you can't go to sleep, you can't think, you can't eat, you can't, you know what I'm saying? You can't have conversations, maybe about like this whole connection, this whole you being with this person, it's almost like it's consuming like your whole life. Um, and I feel like that causes like a tower moment but why does it cause a tower moment if you're in your head it shouldn't bother the other person king of pentacles Ooh, two cards came out three of pentacles and king of pentacles so it looks like you're in your head in this tower moment i'm like i'm stuttering i'm like this t t <laughs> This tower moment was created because this King of Pentacles is like, mm, it's almost like this King of Pentacles like is gonna get what they want out of it, which is super um, selfish for one, but that's also, it's like greedy. There's another word that I'm looking for, but it's like greedy, like, um, you know what I'm saying? It's just like, uh, it's like a succubus, like incubus, succubus type of energy where this person is just going to literally like, if they didn't get what they wanted out of you, they're going to get it from you one way or another. And that sounds horrible. That sounds horrible. I couldn't do that to someone. I just, you know, I think I would just kind of like let the connection die and then very bluntly be like, is this working for you? Like this between me and you, I'm like, is this working? Or what do you, what do you feel about this? You know, cause I feel like you trying to, that other person is them trying to like get back and like, and it's not get back like a vengeance. It's like they invested something and they want to return on their investment. So they're going to do things like, you know, waste your energy and make sure like, you know, you do extra things for them or, um, you know, just things to manipulate you for you to do things for them so they can feel like that they got something out of you worth as much as they put in. Just as much, just as much as worth as they put in. <laughs> just, as, just as much worth as they put in. <laughs> Oh my God, I had some ganja goddess this morning. So if you guys don't know what that is, this isn't for kids anyways, so whatever. Um, So yeah, that's what's kind of happening. There is a full moon coming up, I believe like in like the next like three or four days. Um, So watch out for that because that could be happening around the full moon. I don't have any Oracle cards here for you guys today, um, but I do feel like, ooh. Let's see what's in your person's mind. Spirit, what's in their mind? What's in their person's mind? Queen of Pentacles. So you're on their mind. I'm like, is it going to show? It's so cute. I'm like, I don't know. If you guys can see that, though. 
but look she got the baby on the teeth so yeah like he they're thinking about you but what about you like the fact that like you're abundant you're a money maker you're motivated you're focused yes and yes that is right i like to hear that Mm hmm. What about right? What else? What a, what else about my little cocoa beans? What else? What else about them? What else about if you guys like this video, um, be sure to like um, it means a lot because it lets me know like one who's watching and then two, um, the more you guys are involved. That's the type of videos I make like I support my supporters. So period. <laughs> Okay, uh, what, 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 what else are they thinking about? What else are they thinking about the collective? Okay, uh, Seven of Pentacles, balance. They're trying to figure out how they can balance you and the finances together. Like, they're like, okay, I have my money over here. Like, I need to put my, look, ducks in a row. I need to put my money where my mouth is. I need to figure something out. Like I need to cash this, you know, cash this mule in. And they're also, I'm telling you, a lot of them are thinking about either you think that you're pregnant. Sorry, where are we? Either you think that you're pregnant or this person wants to get you pregnant. So you there, and look, there's a baby already. <laughs> and the time was 11, 11 when I said that. Don't even get them. Get out of here, man, with all that baby energy, you feel me? I mean, unless you're trying to have a baby. I love that. I love that for you. I love that for you. I love that. So, oh my God, this is supposed to have a baby with you. That's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> Anyways, but they're looking at you like, mm, like, if I really want things to work out, I really need to solidify, you know, this person being in my life. I really need this person to be, and vice versa, my gentleman, she's trying to get pregnant by you because she wants a family with you. She sees that. She sees that you're abundant and like how you handle money, but then also handle yourself, you know, so you have like a good balance, but then they're also trying to balance their finances. And this could be like both of you guys also marrying each other. So if money's the issue, why don't you guys come together to build something? Um, but you have to work on it together. You can't just, you know what I'm saying? You can't just let things up in the air. And then I feel like, um, are you prepared for that? Right, 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 right. Um, what other messages do you have? What's on their person's mind? Oh, what's on their person's mind? What's on the collective person's mind? Okay. Okay, so the fool, a new start. They want to be able to... Um, have like a new beginning with you they actually what actually what it is is they daydream and uh, they daydream about having a different life with you or what it could be or they daydream about having a different life and i'm not gonna say with you because i don't know sometimes it is sometimes it isn't but there was a time in their life that they daydream about that they wish their life could be like that so then they could say hey this is what my life is like but it, in actuality when people's life or life is different and um they have more and they things are better you know would they even be looking like your direction so you have to think about that too, Collective, because I love you guys. So you also have to think about that. Like when you help people get into better situations, how are they going to treat you when they get into like a better situation? Because it's a lot different. It could be a lot different from how they treat you now. Especially if they, one, they never had that before. Or two, they don't know themselves. Or three, um, their ego just gets big. It just consumes them, you know? So they do daydream. So they are daydreaming a lot. Um, let's confirm what they're daydreaming about. Sorry. What is the person, what is the collective person daydreaming about? Mm. 
Oh, sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I love you guys, but your person could be thinking about like the same sex. This person could be thinking about, um, yeah, like steamy, hot, same sex. Um, I don't know. It's a lot of men here. That's why I say that. Like, let me look at the pictures at the top. Yeah, this person is like daydreaming of like the same sex or like sexual thoughts as well. Let's see. Um, can you confirm the seven of cups? Okay, so seven of cups having like options. So maybe they think about other people. Maybe they're thinking about other people. Ooh, they're thinking about their ex. Because we have the death card here. Come on now. So this person daydreams about having like the sex that they used to have with their ex. D sight. <laughs> um, I had some fake orange juice today. And the reason why I say that is because it was simply and I don't ever drink juice, but it's giving me the worst headache. Like I was 